Now, the Hollywood actor Alec Baldwin says there are no words to convey his shock and sadness after he shot two people with a gun being used as a prop on the set of his new film. Helena Hutchins, who was the film's director of photography, died, and the director, Joel Souza, was injured. Detectives have questioned Mr. Baldwin, but say no one has been arrested. Sophie Long has more from Los Angeles. Helena Hutchins described herself as a restless dreamer and adrenaline junkie. The 42-year-old was considered by her peers to be an exceptionally talented cinematographer. I met her at a film festival, and within just a few moments of talking to her, I felt like she had such a strong vibe, such a sense of uh, commitment to art and like sort of the integrity of wanting to make cinema that I, I wanted to work with her. She was on set at the Bonanza Creek Ranch in New Mexico when the shootings and deaths depicted on the 19th century western they were filming became all too real. Police say that Alec Baldwin, the star and co-producer of the movie Rust, discharged a prop gun carrying blanks. Helena Hutchins was airlifted to hospital, but she died from her injuries. Director Joel Souza was also seriously hurt. In a statement, Alec Baldwin said, There are no words to convey my shock and sadness regarding the tragic accident that took the life of Helena Hutchins, a wife, mother and deeply admired colleague of ours. I'm fully cooperating with the police investigation to address how this tragedy occurred. I am in touch with her husband, offering my support to him and his family. My heart is broken for her husband, their son and all who knew and loved Helena. The incident has rocked Hollywood, with many of those in the film industry now mourning one of their rising stars and infuriated this could happen on set. And it comes just days after a nationwide strike was averted after a tentative deal between producers and set workers that included an upgrading of safety standards. This isn't the first time someone's been fatally shot during filming. Nearly 30 years ago, Brandon Lee died after being shot by a prop gun on the set of The Crow. Now people are demanding to know how it could have happened again. There are instances when you do shoot a blank um, that you can be injured. Uh, often what comes out of the, of the muzzle uh, after you've uh, discharged uh, the weapon with the, that has blank ammunition is uh, sometimes some, a cotton wad and, and that coming out at a very high velocity to an individual that's fairly close by can cause significant damage and in some cases can cause death. An investigation into what happened here is still in its early stages. What we do know is something went terribly, tragically wrong. Well, local media here in Los Angeles are now reporting that just hours before Helena Hutchins was shot and killed, six camera crew workers walked off the rust set in New Mexico in protest at working conditions. Sources say they were complaining about long hours and pay, with one person saying there was a serious lack of safety meetings on set and that corners were being cut. It's also emerged to Clive that the cinematographer herself had been advocating for safer working conditions for her team. Now, Santa Fe County Sheriff says this is an open and active investigation and that no one has been arrested or charged. Clive. Okay, Sophie, thank you for that. Sophie Long there, live in Los Angeles.